At Dynagy, we've made a promise to our customers to provide fair and simple energy. We've created this series of videos to help fulfill that promise by providing a simple, step-by-step -step explanation of an energy bill. A clear understanding of the bill will empower you to make the best energy choices for your home or business. The first step in understanding the bill is knowing how energy is measured. Most energy suppliers offer two different forms of energy, electricity and natural gas. Your home or business might use one or the other, or it may use a combination of both. Electricity is the most common energy source and powers most of the things we use on a daily basis, like lights, heat and air conditioning, computers and TVs, most major appliances, and anything else that plugs into an electrical outlet. The amount of electricity being used is measured in kilowatts. A watt is a measurement that describes how much electricity is used per second. Kilo means a thousand, so one kilowatt equals 1,000 watts. Kilowatts are abbreviated as KW. To make things easier to manage, energy companies measure how many kilowatts are used each hour. This is called a kilowatt hour, abbreviated as KWH. A 100 watt light bulb takes one kilowatt hour, or 1,000 watts, to keep the light on for 10 hours. A modern day refrigerator typically uses between 350 and 600 kilowatt hours per year, depending on the size and efficiency of the particular model. Energy suppliers typically measure electricity in two ways. The first measure is called energy. This is the actual quantity of electricity used during the billing period and is measured in kilowatt hours. The second measure is demand. This is the rate at which energy is being used and is measured in kilowatts. Measuring demand allows local utility companies to anticipate and plan for the maximum electrical needs of all users in the area. This ensures that facilities are properly sized to handle customer energy needs, and that individual customers are charged fairly based on energy capacity requirements. To help you further understand the difference between the energy measurement and the demand measurement, consider the analogy of an odometer and a speedometer in a car. The energy measurement, kilowatt hours, can be compared to the number of miles driven as shown on the odometer. The demand measurement, kilowatts, is like the speed, or rate at which the miles are driven, as shown on the speedometer. Some people also use natural gas as an energy source. Unlike electricity, gas service is simply measured by the amount of gas used during a particular billing period. Gas usage is measured in cubic feet, with a single unit equaling 100 cubic feet. Each single unit of 100 cubic feet is abbreviated on the billing statement as a CCF. So 99 CCF is the same as 9,900 cubic feet of natural gas used. Dynagy gives you the tools to make the right choice easy.